Hi, I'm Andy Rose of PCT TV, and I'm here today with Dominique Demol, who's the co-founder and CEO of Tools for Patients. Welcome. Thank you very much. So you have a background within pharma, um, mm -hmm. 20 years there as a sponsor, and then moved into became a service provider. What brought you to this new project and co-founding Tools for Projects? Patients. Okay, I, I don't think really there is a, a difference from being in the sponsor company or provider uh, company. I think that at the end of the day, it's all about drug development. Sure. Um, so when we moved to uh, Tools for Patients and setting up Tools for Patients, our main objective was to help with clinical research and maybe address development of compound in a different way, uh, more probably with mathematical type of technology. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and really this is what we are uh, aiming to, is to help predicting how a patient's may answer to a treatment, to a drug, or at the reverse, might not answer. <laughs> to the treatment or to the drug. So sure. help with the decision-making process and ultimately with uh, putting on market innovative drug for sponsor company that we support and for the patients who are waiting for that. Yeah. Uh, great, and, and you're proposing an industrial application for sponsors um, who face placebo effect challenges. Mm -hmm. a big, big challenge for a lot of people. Um, with the placebo response characterization approach? Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Uh, when we, I mean, we were in the sponsor industry and also as a CRO providing uh, advice on the development of new uh, compounds, we have been facing this placebo challenge for decades yeah, yeah, almost. Yeah. And we say, okay, could we benefit from all the academic work that has been done by great uh, people, uh, scientific people, and use this information in a way that it could be implemented in a clinical trial. So uh, we start with this idea of having, uh, being able to characterize for each patient yeah. what would be is or a placebo uh, response okay. rating scale, let's say. And um, this in therapeutic area where the placebo effect is very pronounced will inevitably help to um, your statistical analysis. And this is what we're aiming to. Yeah, it's yeah. really interesting. Um, and how do you see this technology being implemented across other clinical trial activities? In fact, in fact it's uh, to add the technology to a clinical trial, you have to come with something simple. Because as you know, uh, clinical development, the clinical protocols have become tremendously complex. Yeah. A lot of uh, uh, observations made on the patient. So you cannot uh, even complicate more the life of the investigator or of the patient. Yeah. So uh, one of our critical success factor was to have a technology that would be easy of use for the clinical team. And so um, basically it's about a psychological questionnaire that is going to be administered to a patient when just before he received the first dose of the protocol. And after that, all the other data that we need to process the mathematical algorithm and predict the placebo response are anyway collected in any of, uh, if not all, uh, clinical studies, so mm. meaning the demographic data, your disease intensity, for example, uh, your medical history. So uh, for the study team, it's only a study, uh, product, um, sorry, it's only about a questionnaire, but at the end of the day, we put the data from that questionnaire with data that is collected anyway in the study protocol. So simple, yeah. the word is simple. <laughs> yeah, it definitely feels yeah. like there's technologies, there's a lot of exciting opportunities, but there's a lot of challenges still as well. There, there, there are a lot of uh, challenges. I think that, of course, it appears simple to the user uh, behind the scene. Uh, it's 
first of all, for the first application, is four years of research, research yeah. with uh, uh, a lot of different type of expertise. Uh, mathematicians are working with us. Uh, of course, some disease specialists uh, to have the most pertinent question. It's about uh, very high tech statistics as well. So it's a pr the work four years of pluridisciplinary team uh, to achieve the first release of uh, our tools, uh, Placebo for placebo response characterization. So. Oh, that's yeah. great. Well, thank you very much for your time today. Thank you very much to you.